Hello everyone, uh, Abdul Muksit here. Today we're gonna discuss how you can import uh, jet engine glossary in bulk. Right now we don't have any option for that. You have to go to the jet engine dashboard and then glossaries and here you have to add everything manually. Suppose we have a country glossary. Here you have to add everything manually. So let me add some values here. okay and i will save it now if you want to add more countries you have to do it manually uh, actually what happens uh, crocoblock they are using uh, a function uh, or a data storage method which is known as serialization if you want to save something uh, in string or integer in php it's very easy but when it comes to object you have to use a serialized format so if I go here uh, to my database and here we have post type and we check the data here you can see something called glossary the status is glossary okay when I click here on edit in the value I can see something like that okay now it's a multi-dimensional array which is converted to a serialized PHP object and they have pasted it here okay now what we will do first thing we will open excel and here i will go to google and uh, country list github okay so it's this is a list of countries i will copy all of them you can use it for anything like if you have a multi multiple option in select you can use it for sure for that now if we see here we have three uh, three options or uh, three uh, indexes for the multi-dimensional array first one is value and we have label and we have is check okay here what i will do i will write uh, label or value label and is checked okay i will paste the value here okay we have we need the same values in this column okay and for is check we will use zero okay you can change it from the front end later on all right let's double check the columns so we have value we have label and we have is checked okay let's copy all the data we will go to a tool i mentioned in a previous episode also of cct which is known as master data converter We will just paste the values okay now here it can give us a multi-dimensional array based on the output you choose we will choose php now it gives us a multi-dimensional array of php okay what we will do we will copy it okay uh, let's go to w3 schools And let's run it here because it provide us online php scripting okay uh, serialize php okay now here in stack overflow someone mentioned the complete details if you want to read how it works this is a complete documentation of that okay suppose what i will do I will take an array okay which is a array or I will just copy paste the data from here copy and I will paste it here okay now this is a multi-dimensional array with us okay with all the data okay a simply I will provide this a to make it serialize okay or I can simply write echo okay now it gives us this format 
a196 196 mean we have 196 countries here i will copy all of them i will paste this format in the caption also so you can easily copy and paste i will go here and simply i will remove it and i will paste this and save all right so this was our grocery and this is the format let's go back and click on jet engine groceries and click on countries so all the countries are imported to our list okay now if you want to make something is checked you can do it by here let's use it whether it is working or not go to form now we create a new form okay remove post id we don't need that text form uh, username okay and suppose password i'll choose it a password someone want to register okay apply changes so this is username this is password and now i will take another field third field which will show that from which country this user is registered okay add a new field instead of text i will choose select here field name is country label is country and instead of manual input i will choose glossary in glossary i will choose country okay that's it country is here now oh, it's not part of the tutorial but let me mention if we want to register a new user okay username email is username password is password confirm is confirm and country we don't have any option right now so we will leave it as it is apply and publish register form let's go to our pages home page edit with elementor form i'll choose the jet form and here i will choose register okay and update refresh now we have username we have password field and we have the country list okay so that's how you use uh, jet engine glossary if you want to import something actually what happens in 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 serialized uh, array uh, that they convert everything to something like that okay now what a3 means it's uh, three is showing the number of element inside okay i is used for integer s is size for example six so six indicate this one two three four five six okay and so on so we don't need really need to understand all this logic maybe uh, the croco block team they uh, in future they release something uh, through which you can download uh, you can import all uh, glossaries uh, directly but this is a shortcut if you want to use i will copy paste this data in the description if you want to copy if you have any question you can ask in comments thank you so much